Excuse me, sir. May I speak? Oh, you might clear it up. Sir, what doesn't make sense to me is this. If there was an accident that occurred, why weren't the police notified? They were. When? I have the report right here. That's Other the report that, you made. No, not at all. My report was made that the night we were questioning. The night mm -hmm. in question. You don't want to hear what I'm talking about. Yeah, well, how that. is it that you were at the same club they were at, the vehicle your mother rented got ripped off from that club and it just happened to strike them? I have no clue. Because you're what, lying. I'm not lying about anything. Son, I have all you're my lying. Evidence. I have all you're my You're lying. You don't want to listen you to it. Lying. Don't you don't listen to it, but you're not going to you're not, you're not going to sit here put this and not be allow quiet. me to say so my case. Hey, you're not going to do that. Now, you that? keep it up. Let me get my point You across. keep it up. You, you don't have a like point that. because the deeper you, you get like into that, it, the more you get deep, deep into a perjury market. charge. It's not fair. You won't be walking too far without a warrant for your arrest. There's also an ongoing investigation for a felony hit and run, and we've got enough to bust you right here. That's not right, though. Just be fair. That's all I'm it's asking. not your line. That's all Be I'm a asking. man. I am a man. Oh, you, oh, you're not. You got your hands okay. in your pockets. Yeah, well, my body language. Out, you know what I'm that means? The you know what that means? I know what my body language is saying. I will enlighten you and banish some of your ignorance. Now, your well, mother deals with talking. probationers, parolees, and she's listening to you, and she's not even looking at you because she, she's she listening no to your tone. She can sit down. And you can talk to me. Been having problems before. Your mother is disappointed with you. You're 24. Mother, How old are you? 24 years old. You ought to be that? doing something. Sitting up in here trifling and carrying on like you lost your trifling. mind instead of being well, a man. Watch your mouth, man. How's it? He, my he mouth. Call me out of my name, but I can't speak to him. How I want. Because I'll jack that? you up. What's happening? One way or the other. What, what look, happened? Look, fool. Look, don't even go there. Look, I'll, about look you personally. Your mother's mission is a sworn official. I'm thinking of sending this case to the D.A. I didn't do nothing. With a letter. I'm leaving. No, you ain't. Oh, whoa, another hundred. I tell you what. I'm sending it. Send it. You got all my information. And you, you right here. Excuse me. Under arrest, terroristic threats in an official position. Put him under arrest. Guys, go get it. That sounded like a threat to me. Go get it. Because I said, because I said, because I said, I said, you too. That's what I said. I'm not threatening nobody. He's trying to brazen it up. You said you hit him. He said, you said, he put said hands that. on me. He could you have, you that. were unruly. He could eject you. That's what he did. You said that. So I you hit him. I never said that I hit the dude. You feel me? Know what I'm saying? He put his hands on me, trying to put me out his house. And you feel me? I didn't never say that I hit the dude. We're supposed to be talking about the case, and you talking about me. You, you hit me? him. But I ain't the one walking around with a dress on, you feel me? So, I mean, oh, nah, we man, going there. You feel me? Well, okay. You feel me? Let's take what you got on. I do. First time I saw that. You've been listening to your 14-year-old aunt talk about she wants bling. What's a man need jewelry for? You What's got on your a finger? Long... What's on your finger? Well, look, my man. Yeah, yeah. That is a wedding ring. It means right, I have Mr. a wife. Mr. It means I, know, I, know. I don't have any problems. So you are not that tough. But you see, the bottom line is this. These young boys are so desperately in need of men to give them man training. Don't talk about like like you know who my parents are. Oh, I like know you. you. Grew up I can see you. How Man, many thousands playing, of you do you think I have not seen? Man. So what makes you any different from the other thug Man. idiots Man. trying to perpetrate their men? See, you can't even stand up straight. You going because it's not even a case no more, it's about yeah, me. so you, you want to move your head? Yeah, it's, it's a case. It's, it's I'm not just even deciding case how much no punitive more. damages I'm going to hit you with. <laughs> Jack you up. <laughs> and you run around here talking about what you can live off of, and you have no job, you're not in school, you have all that women's jewelry hung around your neck because in your subconscious, when you weren't but five or six, and nobody has seen a man in four or five generations, and if you ask your mother why, uh, why don't you, you need a man to help raise me? I don't understand, Judge, what's good's a man for? Well, there you go, little lady. You don't even know what he's supposed to be good for. How are you going to raise him to be a man? <laughs> See, it falls through the cracks. You running around acting like a hood rat trying to talk about libation to my dead homies. Wait until we get on to the case, man. You feel me? Yeah, no case. You've already done me. it. 
Hit the camera there. Yeah. You feel me? Because I'm finna walk out, man. You can't control yourself. So he's uh, got the... You're his best witness. You can't control yourself. You're not man enough to control yourself. You played punk and you sucker punched him. If it'd been a fair fight and bigger than you, might have whipped your butt. He don't Remember, you so. both played athletics together. So. That means he's got as much you going as you do so. in that Come department. On, See, you Honestly. punked out and sucker punch him because you don't know what in the hell a fair fight is. Hey, you know what I'm saying? 3000 in your like cost. This. Get this punk hey. out of my face. I don't feel as though that I owe her anything because the insurance company, I called the insurance company. They told me that I wasn't reliable for the deductible on the car. All of this is coming down to it because we went to court, me and her son, and she's mad because they didn't get granted what they wanted. You know, it's serious. basically what it comes down to. Like the DNA test came back that it was his to his son, um, his that daughter. That has nothing to do with why she didn't want it to be well, I, his daughter. I, I, let me do that. That's right. She's so correct. It has she, nothing to do with what we're here for today. I understand that, but this is why she's then why are you court. bringing then it if up? If she wanted the money that bad, why did she wait look, two years? Look, I don't care what a motive is. She might detest your very guts. I she's understand got a that, case. She's got a case. Years. If you want the money that bad, why would you wait two years? A week to the day from our court, our our me and her son's court. That's when she filed the paperwork, a week to the day. Oh my so, so if she wanted the $500 that bad, why would point? you wait? Why would you wait two years to do it? Why would she make could. you wait two years? Yeah. I wouldn't have had to make you wait two years. She could. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, my whole thing is, is I don't feel as though that I owe her it. I told her Whoa. to begin with that I didn't. If, so I did, if anything happened to her car, I couldn't pay her is what I told her. I'm like, I don't have the money to pay you. If anything happens to your car... That's it. And I nothing... never let her use my car. No, I never quiet. gave her permission her to use her case. Why don't you just work harder and pay the woman what you owe her? Because I don't feel as though I owe it to her. That's why. That was you drop, uh, driving the vehicle. Yeah, I understand it, but I never that got anything saying I was That was you that couldn't drive and backed into a tow truck yep. hard enough to total the vehicle out. Well, what... The uh, message are you missing about financial responsibility for the state because of Massachusetts? Because I told her that if anything happened to the car, I could not, re be I can't pay her. Well, what did you drive it for? Because I took her son to a court date that he no, had with didn't. her car. She did not. She did not. That's exactly what Excuse I did. Excuse me. Okay. Where have you been for your whole life? Have you been part of some secret space program and you live on a planet? No, I haven't, but that's, I don't feel Are you an alien entity that's masquerading <laughs> nope. as the first phase of the upcoming invasion? No. Nope. You've she's been in the Twilight Zone someplace in a time my daughter. That's what yourself? it comes down to. Yeah, I do, and that's why you're mad. That's this what is it what comes I have down to deal to. with. Unbelievable. Why are you mad? It doesn't make any it difference. Make any why? Sense. Because if she wasn't mad about everything, oh, we wouldn't be standing Susan, here right now. You, it's, no, you're not making sense. No, that's not quite why we're here. Now, you're about to get the DOD award. <laughs> <laughs> so be it. That stands for Dummy of the Day Award. Yeah. <laughs> what are you responsible for? Not that. All right, how about the loans? Uh, is she responsible for that? She didn't loan me any money. The two hundred and fifty dollars was a gift for me for my license to get wow. reinstated. Oh, give money, you a gift. Okay, let me give you the this. Other wait, 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 wait. Time out. Time out. You can't drive anyway, so it would have been safer for the citizens of the state of Massachusetts, the Commonwealth there, for you not to have then your why driver's she gave license. Me the money. Ask getting, her why. What did she owe you? She didn't owe me anything. Well, then she why the should she give you a gift? As a gift she doesn't like birthday. you, remember? Well, Your whole thesis is she's doing this out of revenge because she don't like me. But she gave me the money before the car got crashed. Oh, but oh. she doesn't like you because you took her son in and jacked him around, she thinks, the way you say. <laughs> yeah. Okay, how about to the housing authority? Why should Price she pay? Her son was staying with me, gift. so he paid, she gave uh -huh. him the money to pay the rent. Oh, well, by right. the way, your son's getting SSI. What for? He's on a disability. I see. There you go. She's protecting somebody who is in 21 in high school getting an SSI check. So what'd you just do? You took advantage of somebody. Exactly. Yeah, I took advantage exactly. of him and had a baby with exactly. him. I know. I know, because you have no sense. Fit. Got a seven-year-old. Oh, what does that make? You started off at 14? At oh, 17, nice. actually. 17. Yep. Oh, you're 24. Yeah. Oh, okay, I got that wrong. You started off at 17. Very good. Now you got a seven-month-old. Yep. And you took somebody in getting an SSI check with a payee. 
uh, who is struggling along trying to make it because he's got difficulties. Yeah, and I'm on Social Security, too. I have difficulties, too. Well, what are your difficulties? I have dyslexia. That's what my difficulty is. Dyslexia? Yeah. <laughs> she blames that on everything. Oh, I got it. She just doesn't move around too fast. She likes to sit at home. Exactly. Yep. Because you don't sit at home, too, right? You are. Exactly, Susan. Exactly, you are. I wish you I could know. hear I yourself. You I really wish you could hear yourself. She hear works. Myself. She's got a checking account that paid for your yeah, welfare housing head. on two uh, occasions. That paid you. for your non-driving, broke, angry self to get her driving privileges restored. You don't like you very much. Mm -hmm. That's what the problem. She right. doesn't like herself. Right. That, that yeah. anger. Mm -hmm. Leads to the dark side. Yeah. <laughs> you address your tabulation device. I haven't done this in a good few weeks. You got those down there. The proposition is the defendant is pathetic. Yes or no? <laughs> Now, why don't you stop making excuses for what you think is your sorry existence and exercise your worth as a human being and be something. The world owes you exactly what you earn, and right now you aren't earning much. How much is two times two? Four. Okay, what's one half of four? One and a half, or two and a half. I'm not stupid. Two and a half. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you're working my nerves. You're working my nerves, man. Get a good laugh there. Go ahead. What does math have to do with while we're here? Nothing. It has to do with your ability to engage in logical, reasonable, and rational thought and comport yourself accordingly, since obviously your cognitive abilities, not your skills, are suspect. <laughs> Maybe I can't hold you to that standard. That no, any intelligent, can't. reasonable, logical person would find that your position is absolutely, atrociously ridiculous <laughs> and wrong. But obviously, since you have some... Uh, challenges to being able to wrap your mind about those concepts, uh, maybe I shouldn't hold it against you. And by the way, if you're that dumb, why don't you stop having more kids out of wedlock you can't you. support so we don't have any more and we're not here big for dummies we're here running for around a being bill. a big dummy like you. I'm not no big dummy. You already proved it. I'm not no big dummy. No, I'm not. What's math have to do with it? Exactly. What does math have to do with why we're here? We're not here to take a GED Because you can't add up Bill. what's going on here. You don't get it. All right, can we get back in with the case? Oh, and you got a bad, nasty temper, too. Come on. Well, at least you can be polite and sweet yeah. about it. If you're dumb, I mean, the dummies get back and at least try to be quiet so they don't get in anybody's way. Dumb. Oh, yes, I am. Violently wrong. Yeah, I agree with you. I agree with you, too, sir.